Hi Sexy, I'm Lexi and welcome back to my YouTube channel. <laughs> So in today's video, we are going to be doing the Sephora sale haul. So this just happened, it ended in April, on April 24th. This should be going live on Sunday, which I believe this Sunday is like the 13th. However, I finally got all the stuff that I ordered and I really wanted to show you guys a bundle of everything that I got because I wanted to show the girlies what I got. Sorry if you guys can hear my laundry and dryer going on in the background, but I really, 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 really had to get that stuff done, girls. So it is going on while we are doing this. This is my natural hair texture. I've been really trying to figure out the curls and like the waviness. So don't mind it. It's just a little bit crazy right now. But anyways, with that being said, let's get into the video. First thing we're gonna start with is some hair care stuff because I was just talking about hair, so we might as well start off with it. So we're gonna start off with the two go-to products that I've been using for a really long time. So I'm gonna tell you guys a little bit of a backstory. So a long time ago, about almost two years ago now, I um, had really long hair, like all the way down to my butt almost. And I went and got it bleached and the bleach was just like on my hair for too long And I think it was just like too high of a, of a developer and it just made my hair really 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 dead and dry and My hair I therefore had to cut it all off um, So I did that and then I had really short hair and my hair used to be like up to here because I just wanted it all off Like I just wanted to restart get it going and in that process I found that my hair was kind of falling out with all the breakage from the blonde and all that kind of stuff and I was in the process of finding some kind of product and like hair products that were really gentle on my hair and still got the job done so I ended up finding the the Moroccan oil and this is the um, oh I didn't end up getting the version that I usually like which is really annoying usually I like the one that's for dry or not dry hair sorry fine hair um, it's the one that's like uh, volumizing or whatever because I like the way that it's it's a good formula that was the reason why I was saying this but I ended up ordering the wrong one which is fine like it'll it'll be good but basically the reason why I like that version is because it's good for your hair um, for hair that's really fine which at the time my hair was just feeling really dry feeling very fine and brittle so it really helped I found that it brought my hair so much shine like as you can tell my hair just looks really good right now so it's all thanks to Moroccan oil, girl. Um, next thing, you guys can tell that I colored my hair a little bit. I put some highlights in there, um, and I also had like my hair dyed brown um, because, like I said, I was a blonde before. And so, with that being said, there is a little bit of orange in my hair sometimes, and with the sun being out and stuff, my hair just the tone is like crazy. So I wanted to get some no orange um, shampoo. So I got the Finola um, shampoo. I love this stuff. When I tell you, it literally will stain your hands. It stains my hands. Like it is so crazy the difference this makes in your hair. I swear, you just, you gotta use it. Next thing we have on the list, another absolute must have for me when it comes to hair care that I've recently fit, found and like started obsessing over in the recent, very recently in my hair care journey. This is the Amika Soul Food Nourishing Mask. Oh my gosh, I can't explain to you enough how amazing this product is. It is so stunning. It really does hydrate your hair. I've tried so many masks in my life. I've done homemade masks. I've done so many masks. I've gone to salons to get professional masks and nothing leaves my hair feeling this way that this Amika does. Um, I use it in my hair almost like conditioner because I only wash my hair once a week or if I have some kind of shoot or something going on like this week I'm gonna wash my hair twice a week because I have a photo shoot on Friday So I'm gonna do my hair on Friday Friday morning or maybe Friday night. We'll see So that's just kind of those are my favorite hair care products. They've really changed my life I also did get a little travel Moroccan oil, but I do not have that here with me But it's just the classic Moroccan oil oil and you guys know what that looks so like. let's go on to Oh, actually, I'm sorry. I have one more hair care product. This is another one of my favorite must-haves um, It's the K teen leave-in molecular repair hair mask I love this one. It, it does really just feel so nourishing on your hair. I haven't used this in a while, but I like to use this when it becomes the summertime because I feel like the summer just dries your hair out like crazy. And it's really important to keep it very moisturized in the summertime. So does the winter, but the sun is just, it hit like, it just takes a different hit to your hair. 
Um, let's do some skincare. Actually, you know what? Let's do makeup products because I don't have very many very many makeup products. I only have like three. So let's do makeup products now. So the first thing we have is just a re-up that I needed to order again. It is the Milk Makeup um, Hydrating, or what is it? The Grip Primer. I love this primer so much. This one is honestly, truly super amazing. And the quality of this is just chef's kiss. I love it. It's, it's really freaking good. Um, next thing on the list is the, uh, what is it called? Soft Pinch Tinted Lip Oil. And I got this in the color Joy. So I've had her lip oil, or sorry, not, not her lip oil. I had her um, cheek blush in the shade Grace, and I loved that. Should we put this on my lips right now? Just kind of wipe that off. I'll put this on. So this is the Rare Beauty Joy Tinted Lip Oil. Let's see. Hmm. I like the color. Cute. I like the color, I like the texture, I like the way that it feels on my lips. It is really glossy, but it really does feel like an oil. Like it doesn't feel like an actual gloss. It feels very like oily. Like not like actual oil, but the texture is just as if you were to put like bio oil or something on your lips really quick. The next thing that I got is the Soft Pinch Matte Liquid Blush, and this is in the shade Love. So I don't believe I have any blushes in this shade. It is a very like coppery tone. But as you guys can see, I don't know if you can see the true color the way that it's coming up. Let's just put a little dot on my hand. Can you guys see that? It's like a ready kind of copper tone. Um, I have blue eyes and this shade, this like kind of copper tone is a really good shade to kind of wear next to blue eyes. So I wanted to try it out and see how it goes. So I'll, I'm will i not gonna wear it today because I don't have my brush next to me that I need, but I will try it in the future. So stay tuned for that. All right, next things on the list we're gonna do is skincare. So I mostly got things that I just normally get as well and I just needed to like reorder them. So let me show you what I got. We're gonna start off with the polypeptide by Drunk Elephant. So. I had this one in the little bit smaller version. Um, it's like the one that's this big, so it's not the full size like this one. But I wanted to get the full size, especially while it was gonna be on sale with the Sephora sale, so we definitely took advantage of that. So I just got this one in the big size. I'm not gonna open this one up or use it until my other one is out, because the other one still has a ton in it. I just, like I said, wanted to kind of stock up on that one. But I love it. I feel like it does amazing wonders for my skin. I also have started using the Snail um, mucin serum, love it. And I also use the hyaluronic acid serum from Ordinary, and those are like my go-to face serums. Okay, next on the list is the Peace Out Acne. These are just 40 acne treatment dots. I love these, these are great for overnight. I am a picker of my skin, so it's really nice to wear these so I don't pick out like full, full crazy whiteheads. Like, I like to put these on whiteheads and stuff that I just know I shouldn't pick at, so these are really helpful. Next thing on the list is something that I found thanks to TikTok and it is just the best thing I've ever purchased in my life and I only bought it in the tester because at the time, I actually talked about this on my latest YouTube video. If you guys went and watched that, it was the one where, have I posted that YouTube video? Yes, it was the glow up YouTube video so you guys can go watch that but I went to go find this in store and I couldn't find it anywhere in store and I got it in the testing size, so that was awesome. I was able to like try it out and see if I even liked it. I ended up loving it, falling in love with it. But this is the Autocorrect Brightening and Depuffing Eye Contour Cream. This, when I'm, I'm literally not lying when I say this is the best under eye cream I've ever had in my life. Like, I am someone who does struggle with eye bags because I just struggle with puffing in general. Um, my lymphatic drainage system is not as good as I wish it was, so I have to rely on just like other products, not as much sodium, lots of water, yada yada, you know the whole thing, and like, you know the shebang. Sometimes eye bags are just something that I can't get to just go away, so I really, 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 really wanted to have a product that I know will just get rid of them, and I heard so many raves about this on TikTok, it was going viral, and I finally got my hands on the full-size product. So, this is the Sunday Riley's full-size, be gone eye cream. 
uh, Be Gone Under Eye Circle Eye Cream. That's not what it's actually called, but that's just what I like to call it because it literally works like magic. I forgot to show you guys what the Milk Pro, or sorry, what the Milk Hydro Grip Primer looks like, but it just looks like this. It's just the classic blue. You know, the whole shebang. But yeah, this was everything that I got in my Sephora end of the season haul. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Make sure you go follow all my social medias. They will be linked down below. Big thank you to everyone who watches this. Honestly, I know that my channel is small at the moment, but I just really appreciate everything that you guys do for watching. and. I really do hope that you enjoy the content that I make for you. It's kind of just a variety of a whole bunch of different things. And yeah, I really hope you're enjoying and I will hopefully see you guys in the next one. Bye, sexy. Mwah.